We start off with some breaking news. The lawyer who accused Justice Swatantra Kumar of sexually harassing her when she was interning with him in 2011 has now sought action against the former Supreme Court judge. The victim's lawyers will petition the Apex Court today, seeking an early hearing in the case. The alleged incident took place in 2011 when Justice Kumar was still a Supreme Court judge and the lawyer was interning with him while she was studying at Kolkata's National School of Judicial Sciences. Now, the victim is likely to seek a vindication of the truth of her allegations in her affidavit to the Supreme Court. Now, the allegation she first made in an affidavit to the Chief Justice of India on November 30th of last year. Now, in fact, at this coming, and remember, this is after Justice A.K. Ganguly was also slapped with a similar charges where uh, he, in fact, he had to step down as uh, the West Bengal uh, Human Rights Commission's chief after pressure from several quarters after he was accused of sexually harassing an intern in 2012. But now, uh, another judge from the Supreme Court, which is uh, Justice Swatantra Kumar, the victim uh, likely to seek vindication of the truth of her allegations in her affidavit to the Supreme Court. The lawyer, in fact, petitioning the Supreme Court, uh, uh, remember this, uh, she claimed that she was, in fact, sexually harassed uh, by this judge in 2011 when she was interning with him. And the victim's lawyers will actually petition the Apex Court today, seeking an early hearing in the case. Now, the alleged incident took place in 2011 when Justice Kumar was still a Supreme Court judge and the lawyer was interning with him while she was studying at uh, Kolkata's National School of Judicial Sciences. Now, uh, this, in fact, this, uh, this new case coming to the fore, remember, after several law interns have, in fact, spoken out against uh, their seniors and uh, judges about uh, sexual harassment. And this lawyer who has, in fact, accused Justice Vatanta Kumar of sexually harassing her when she was interning with him in 2011 has now sought action against the former Supreme Court judge. Now, the victim is, in fact, uh, likely to seek vindication of the truth of her allegations in her affidavit to the Supreme Court. Now, this is the allegation she first made in the affidavit, remember, to the Chief Justice of India on November the 30th last year. But now, this is the big breaking news that is coming in right now. The lawyer has, in fact, petitioned the Supreme Court. Um, she has, uh, in fact, a, wants a, a formal complaint against Swatendra Kumar.